Hi, everybody. My name is Michelle Thomas. I'm a medical intuitive, energy healer, psychic, and transformational coach with Radiant Living and RadiantLivingHLC.com. Welcome to our week ahead forecast. I'm a little bit amped up because my Heal Yourself Challenge starts today. If you have not signed up, there's still time. Um, RadiantLivingHLC.com slash HYC to be able to grab your spot in this free challenge. I am so excited to share it with everyone. So grab your spot. It's not too late. You'll get an email and you can have access to the Facebook group. And uh, away we go. I'm so excited. It's five days of transformation. We're talking intuition and chakras inner child wounds and money blocks and manifestation. We'll have Q&A. We're giving away prizes. I'm going to be doing card readings. Super fun. Uh, just an amazing uh, event. So if you are interested, go to my website, radiantlivinghlc.com slash HYC and grab your spot. Um, also, replays will be available both in the Facebook group as well as I send them out um, in an email later in the day. So it, just in case you can't make the lives, that's okay. You can still participate and have a great time. All right. So what does our week ahead forecast have for us? So the energy of the week is treasure island, treasure island. Okay. So our treasure, right? All the things that we're trying to manifest is right in front of us, right? You just need to follow the path. Um, in order to do that, uh, it helps if you tune into your intuition to make sure you're not making any wrong turns and taking the scenic route instead of the shortcut. So follow the breadcrumbs that spirit is giving you, right? Listen to those gut messages, pay attention to those intuitive hits, whether you get them during meditation or when you're driving to work or uh, in the shower, right? Intuition doesn't ever sort of turn off, right? Um, but making space every single day to tune in is super helpful as well, because then you're saying, my doors are open. I'm turning on the lights. The store is open and I'm ready for some messages. So, um, and if you don't know how to do that, again, today is intuition day. We are talking how to do, how to tap into your intuition. Um, I also have a free guide on my website to, uh, it's called intuition in an instant. Um, and you can grab your free guide as well, just to give you some key tips and tricks um, to be able to tune into your intuition on demand. Um, so they're just really saying like all the things that you want are right in front of you. You just have to follow the breadcrumbs that spirit's leading you. Um, okay. So what what is something that might be blocking us this week is yang yang and yang is all about this masculine energy of doing right of achieving of taking uh, being the leader of your own life taking charge right and taking action on the things that you need to do in order to find your treasure right so listening to your intuition and then when they give you these intuitive hits take the steps necessary to actually make it happen you can't just sit back eating bonbons on the couch and just waiting for it to arrive right you need to take some action in order to make it happen right um and what are some what are some actions that we can take interesting enough it's like the opposite um and it's called time for a nap so the actions that we can take and what spirit's telling me is you need to take action, but you also need to tune into your body. And when it needs to rest, when it needs to recuperate, when it needs to be integrating, um, making sure that you're listening to that intuitive message as well. So taking those necessary actions, but you need to rest and you need to do self care. You need to go outside and get grounded um, in, in order to really sort of allow all of these things to happen. So it's a little yin and yang, to be honest, um, is do the thing. And then when you need to rest, rest, right? Um, because that's the energy for the week is uh, do the thing and then rest um, and allow your body to, to really sort of integrate with all the changes that are happening um, and not let fear get in the way and all of those things. And then spirit's guidance for us is round and round. And round and round is all about repeating patterns, right? When we start repeating the same patterns, when we have um, these thoughts in our head, when we have these beliefs, when we tell ourselves these stories, um, it creates this just pattern in our lives. It's like the same, you get on the hamster wheel and it doesn't take you anywhere, right? It's that treadmill. You're never going to move anywhere. You're going to still be seeing the same scenery. Um, so you need to get out of those repeating patterns. Um, in order to do that, again, my challenge is coming up. It's today um, for the rest of the week. Um, and I'm going to help teach you how you can get out of some of the stuff that 
is holding you back, especially those crappy beliefs and stories. Um, and I'll tell you how you can heal some of that stuff in the Heal Yourself Challenge. Um, but it's time to get out of the pattern. Step out of it and like move yourself forward. Stop feeling stuck, right? And if you're feeling stuck, you need to figure out why you feel stuck. Um, is it because you're not making a decision? Is it because you don't know where you wanna go? Uh, and if you don't, it's time to tune in and figure that out. So I hope you have a fantastic week. I hope I will see you in my challenge later today. Um, the Heal Yourself Challenge, Radiant Living, hlc.com slash HYC. Um, I'm teaching a class here in Denver on Tuesday night. So if you're in Denver and you want to learn how to heal your inner child at an even deeper level than what I'm going to be teaching in my challenge, um, you can find that event here on Radiant Living's um, Facebook page under events. Um, on Wednesday, I'm doing gallery readings with Violet Rain at Discover Your Spiritual Gifts. We are going to be giving messages from Spirit on Wednesday evening. So if you're interested in that. Um, and then on Sunday, I am teaching a virtual class, Instant Intuition. Um, also, again, all of those events are here on my Facebook page. Um, or you can find it under radiantlivinghlc.com and go to the healing classes tab um, for more information. But I hope you have a fantastic week and I will catch you guys all soon.